killed me. Gunner's charge shot is much weaker than Samus's. Uh, but we're gonna go uh, game one. Give the damage going, me, Gunner. Oh, okay. Inkling. We're seeing Nico go Inkling. All right, give the damage. Starting to try to get stage control early. Taking the center stage, using uh, the fire to keep control. Oh yeah. Already put it on off stage, but Inkling getting right in there with that up throw up there, bread and butter. Nice nair to get himself out of that combo instead of just trying to air dodge and maybe getting reset. Just tosses that. What did I say? Point, Give the damage. Point lives, F smash. <laughs> lives up to his name. Look and at again. these F smashes, bro. <laughs> Look at these F smashes. He's relentless. You know what they say. If it ain't broke, <laughs> keep going until it breaks. Um... <laughs> All right, nice back air to regain stage control, but give the damage is doing a great job of walling him out with these projectiles. Yeah, he's um, he's having a little bit of a trouble. He's not reestablishing his range after the uh -oh, guy gets. Oh, he's out of ink. Ooh. He's out of ink and two failed attempts at that roller there. As an inkling player, it's Splatoon 101, my man. You always gotta watch your ink. Man, I only play Call of Duty. I don't know about no <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> Another F smash just tossed out there, although Give the Damage is able to do that with a little leniency just because it's a disjoint for his F smash with that rapid fire. Give the Damage is going to need to start reestablishing his range once Inkling gets in. Oh, yeah. Notice he's not boxing once he's in and he's not getting, have the space to, to set back up like he wants to. Definitely. Not able to keep uh, Nico out so well, even game here. But that down smash going to clinch that first stock from Nico. Clean up, clean up. Oh, but a Put back air right away from the spawn point will tie this game right up. And the angel came down from the Wait, platform. Wait, did you see that? He just hit his bomb right back at him. Did you see that? I did see that. <laughs> that was weird. I didn't know you could do that. I didn't think this was DDD, but fine. <laughs> nice use of bomb to get him. Man, these Diddy Fairs really coming in hand, in handy for Nico, just walling him out. Oh, he could have had a chance to recover and get some damage off of that bomb, but he wouldn't Another adjust the angle. Another F smash at 50. <laughs> Give it the damage. Oh my goodness. Just like I said. Nico getting a little bit of ink. All right, Nico getting a little bit of a lead here, but give the damage, keeping it close. Not really converting from these side Bs. The, He's kind of just looking to establish his zone. Yeah, this these diet PK fires not really working out for him. Yeah, it's like slim fast, man. <laughs> oh, an SD, unfortunate. Uh, unfortunate SD. Damage trying to get some early pressure on him. Can't give, get anything out of give it. Give the damage guy do a little better job keeping Nico out and clinch the stock before he gets too much extra credit tacked onto him. Up throw, nice shield up, throw up air, let's go. I thought that was Inklings. Give the damage, try and correct me, saying I can't just throw out F smashes. I got grab confirms as well. Let's go. But they, uh, just as I said, that another F smash to get him off stage. This is fun. This is so much fun. <laughs> like I say, though, give the damage is throwing a lot of point blank PK fires. He's getting punished sometimes for it. He might want to wait until he knows he has the, the range to actually do it. Definitely true, but not punished enough. Good nice side beat a fair. You see, the platforms actually seem to be hindering his uh, his fires. Yeah, I noticed that. His bombs keep getting trapped on the platform before they can reach Kip Nico. I actually want to see a few more bombs from him. He's kind of not taking advantage of that opportunity. To... Oh, yeah, definitely. Off stage, both able to recover. Another F That's smash. Nice. He must have staled the heck out of that by now. Good just... back air. I shield grab. Or grab, I should say. Oh, could have got an F smash to seal the game, but opts for a fair. Did you happen to know if that uh, Gunner Up B has a hitbox? It does at the bottom, right? Oh, I believe okay. so. So he's not going to be doing any aggressive. Oh, <laughs> the roller being stopped in its tracks, and then uh, F smash, of course. Just so everyone oh, knows, bombs course. are stronger than paint rollers. Right. The the paint roller being stopped right in its tracks by the bomb. Oh, Very my. nice counterplay, actually, by give the damage, and of course. I'm he has to seal it out with that F smash. There were plenty of F smashes. Oh yeah, tons. He's kind of catching every time uh, Nico's coming in. He's kind of going ham a little bit. He's and uh, gives the damage. Is getting the damage. Oh yeah, living right up to his name. We're going uh, game two. Let's see where where he opts for. See if we get a character switch. It seemed dead even the entire game. Oh yeah, there wasn't anybody getting bodied. Lots of back and forth, definitely. What do you think uh, Nico has to do to adjust in this game too? 
maybe take a he needs to um, like I was saying, he needs to take advantage of the fact that Gives of Damage was kind of just guilt he was falling into a pattern of doing his fires and doing his bombs yeah. instead of adjusting for what was actually happening. Exactly. And like when it worked, it worked, but when it didn't, he was getting a lot of damage. So he needs to like wait, maybe find find the holes, jump in the holes and do, and do what he needs to do. That's a good one. good analysis going into this game too. I was just gonna say pick a character royal or a reflector. <laughs> but nevertheless, we're gonna go F D for game two, give the damage up one oh, trying to seal out this set. But let's see if Nico can bring it back and force a game three. Doing what I said, coming in, right? He's getting on the inside of the fires and coming in and getting oh, his yeah. damage. Inkling can be such a good zone breaker with that low pro profile dash. Low profile, fast aerial is not mm -hmm. going to worry about getting a. Oh, but oh. keeping him at the ledge really well with these Diet PK fires. Double edged sword of FD. There's a lot of zoning that can be done here. Oh, yeah. Back on stage. Nice use of bomb to get him a little bit of real estate. Oh, yeah, definitely. He uses it again. But Nico goes high. Back throw. Oh, as he expected, the F smash. Good reaction time from Nico, knowing exactly what he's opting for. I want to see Nico put his his flat bombs on stage because he's kind of just throwing it off. Yeah, it's getting him. It's getting him a little bit of that fear space, but he's not getting any stage control off of it. But give the damage, retaining stage control, actually backing himself into a corner just trying to get the distance. He's content to lock down the middle of the stage with his bombs. But a nice down tilt will get him off stage. The weak hit of the fair, not going to do it. Oh, but that was a free down smash. But nevertheless, co covers the neutral get up with the fair. Give the damage, down a stock now. Nico's going to want a nickel and dime here. He doesn't have to be a hero. He just has to be effective. All the Mies, especially me, Gun, are not phenomenally known for their damage output. So 84, 98% now, not looking so good, but it's definitely within uh, comeback range. Right. Oh, good nice roller. roller. No conversion off of it, unfortunately. Looking a little low on ink. Nico needs Falling to watch the F ink. Smashes. If you could jump in and fade back just to bait out some of these F-Smashes, you Definitely. get a lot of damage off the punch. Oh, yeah. Charges ink while, <laughs> while the other charges the charge shot. Nico doesn't have to do anything. He can just keep throwing these bombs, really. I think give the damage is respecting Nico's space way too much. Mm -hmm. He's letting him have the stage. He's oh, letting yeah. him have his little little bit of damage. Oh. Oh, you know, the F-Smash again. The and that kills smash. off the top. Physics don't work like that. Oh, no. We ain't take physics in school, boys. Uh -huh. But give the damage down 82% credit. Nice frame trap. Didn't get his up air off his up throw, but he did get a fair when he air dodged out. Damage is using a lot of these falling PK fires to just clear himself room. Oh, yeah. Just like you said, I want to see Nico use the splat bomb a little more intentionally, either for an edge trap or just to force pressure on stage. He just wants to put his hands on it. Oh, yeah. A lot of down smashing. If you're not the optimal punish, you might just want to start jabbing more, especially because he's still got the lead. Oh, considerable yeah. lead. But a good back air will toss and give the damage right off stage. This might be a good chance time to go for a roller. Like I said, if he gets in the... Oh, I thought he was about to hit him again if you get that juggle going. Oh, almost directionally air dodged off stage. That would have been bad Nico for Nico. A, he was about to pull the roller out. Give the damage has basically brought this all the way back. One good F smash will take the okay. stock with all much rage yeah, he's accumulated. A lot of nickel and diamond. Oh, yeah. Ooh. But a nice down smash catching his landing. Give the damage down another stock. He got turned yeah, around and grabbed the wrong way. If he doesn't, if Nico doesn't turn up the aggression, we will be seeing a game three in this winner's round one. Goes up to scare him a little bit, doesn't get any edge guarding off of it. One thing I'm also I'm not seeing a whole lot of from the inkling is uh, dash back, dash dancing back and forth, using that low profile to go on. There's some of uh, the higher options, I guess you could say. It's true. I haven't been seeing Nico utilize inkling's movement options, but at the same time, when you have diet PK fires and bombs being thrown at you every two seconds, it's not like he needs to psych out, give the damage right. with his movement, because he's just going to run into a trap at that point. I'm waiting for him to tech read. Getting a lot of hits and then coming in and then just going straight for the shield grab instead of dashing a little, an inch further and getting punished. Yeah, but Nico still living at 192. Yeah. It's been a while since we've there seen the F smash. He knows. He held, he held on to it. It was in the pocket. He pulled it out when he needed it. The That's damage read my mind. It just threw out that F smash to turn it off the side. Oh, oh no, but refuses. 
doesn't get the tech, and we are going. Actually, no. Give the damage. Ceiling. No. I was, I was right the first time. We're going to game three. Nico. Nico won. Nico won. I got so confused for a second. I was like, wait. No, we are going to game three. <laughs> Let's see what stage. Oh, you know give the damage. What stage is he like? If I was good, I would definitely... I would definitely, if I was, uh, if I was uh, Nico, I'd definitely get rid of the flat stages. Definitely pick some platform stages because, as we saw in that game one, the platforms really were messing up uh, the damages projectile game, especially with those bombs getting caught on the platforms. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, I have to cough my lungs up. <coughs> Stay it's all healthy, right, people. Man. I'm alive. Stay healthy, y'all. It's drink cold out water. there. Just don't drink it in the wrong tubes. It's cold outside. It's so cold, and we're not in the deep. Sorry. <laughs> and you know why, where I want to be right now? Florida. I'd love to be out Florida right now. This is a good opportunity to talk about how we should have smash seasons, and all the winter <laughs> tournaments should be in Florida, and all the summer tournaments should be in Michigan. Mm. Oh. We have lost stream. We have lost stream, ladies and gentlemen. <coughs> okay, we back. We back. We back. We back. It just kind of kinked out there for a second. Excuse me. Sorry, folks. We've got technical difficulties. Apologies. All right, we're all good. Taking a good long time on that stage pick. We are going to. Let's see where they decide to go to for this deciding game three of their set. Ah, yes. Yes, very nice. Just like I said, you want to use those platforms and maybe catch some of the Me Gunners moms. One thing's going to be interesting is seeing how the projectiles interact with the tilts because um, a lot of them, um, especially the bombs, those things can kind of roll down those, those slopes. Mm -hmm. You might actually be able to make, make use of that. Brawler? Is he gonna switch? Are we gonna see a oh, switch? We're, we're, going, we're about to cycle through all the maze today. I was about to say. I'm oh. surprised. I'm actually surprised. Give the damage is not going Ganondorf in this matchup. Inkling definitely known for its inability to kill sometimes. Ganon will live forever. I don't know. Maybe he just seems wants like worth the shot. Seems like it was worth the shot. I mean, it's because he wanted to play the Bob Ross, obviously. Ah, uh, obviously. We have to see it. But opting for me, Sword Fighter now, give the damage off to a 50% 50 50 start, but Nico he, trying to fire back. The first time he had a tech, he immediately hit a whirlwind off of it, so he <laughs> clearly has some kind of plan in mind. This character is absolutely insane with what he can do from the tornado. And that up air just being so dangerous. Just Yeah, he's cool. looking to shark. This is, just, this is just Jaws Redux. That's correct. <laughs> All right, he's just going to frame trap him to death. I think that's the plan. That tornado, not a very fast projectile, but covers so much of the stage. It's really intimidating. And the fact that it confirms into things just scares you. Oh, yeah. All right. Nico getting the stage back. Ooh, Ooh nice, nice up smash to catch his landing on that platform. Scoops. Scoops for days. Throwing out a lot of down smash. He's kind of looking to get landed on aggressively to give the damage he's not handing it to. Oh, but fails to recover there. I don't know if he burned his jump too early. Let me just talk about... Okay. But that up air just going to take that stock right back. We're at even game, folks. I want to talk for a little bit. <laughs> nice. Oh, I was about to say nice use of platforms, but he dropped the rest of the combo. As soon as we have something to say about this game, one of the players just corrects us right away in game. <laughs> Nico was looking to take him all the way up to the top for the uh, get the damage air dodge the right way. These, they sword fighters aerials are just. Oh, look for the hero spin confirm. He's a little bit too late. Nice bomb. Ah, uh, but doesn't get anything. Now, do you know if the splat bomb has has a big enough hitbox to go underneath the platform? Definitely the not. The strongest hit, or just the hitbox in general of this splat bomb, is right in the center. So if you're under the platform, it definitely won't catch you. All right, you. so it's not C4. All right. No, no, nothing like C4. We don't oh, need okay. any of that. Another up air is going to take out that stock from give the damage. Nico. Damage took him here with the wall. There's a roller to F smash. Good confirm. Didn't kill. Oh, didn't kill using that side B. 
to recover there. This is where damage is going to win. It just keeps sharking underneath the platforms. He took him here with the express intent. You guys there? Okay. Oh, that hitbox took him right out of the splat bomb blast radius. Oh, but another down smash. We're just seeing these raw down smashes for Nico giving most of his stocks. Not seeing a lot of roller confirms. That's what I wanted to see Nico's doing. He started jumping around the zone and come down and landing aggressively. Oh, but there's the roller. I was about to say, you see what I mean when I say they just correct us every time we say yeah. something they could be doing better? That's Absolutely. adaptation, folks. That's I like it. Point That's blank really win, no confirms off of it. As long as uh, give the damage gets him above him, it's going to be curtains. Just keep him at bay with these whirlwinds. Give the damage looking really good right now, sitting on a nice lead. I do like how damage is working. No, no, no. Point blank, with I was about to say, he's been using jabs to keep him out when he gets too close for comfort. Right. Seems a lot more. Another tornado, another tornado. Damn it, Nico getting so, having such a hard time getting in right now. Ink, Inkling, not a great character playing from behind. Let's see what Nico can do. Damage is looking to get some bait, some bait, some bass fish out of this lake. He's fishing all right. But then Roll. again, you can't count Nico out yet. Oh, that bounces, that bounces flat bomb back too. Can't count Nico out yet. Me Sword Fighter doesn't have the best recovery, so a gimp could be imminent. Damage is absolutely content to sit on one side of the stage and zone. I'm really having trouble deciding if Nico is doing, a, if damage is getting, doing a, oh, Ooh. but never mind. I'm trying to figure out, is he's doing a good job avoiding the roller, or if Nico it just isn't using the roller enough? He's not finding an opportunity to do, <laughs> oh, oh, but yeah. that raw F smash, of course, give the damage, taking the set and the stock with F smash. Good stuff. Give the damage, take the stock. That's give the damage, moving on in bracket. Nico dropping down the losers round.